Oh gosh. I do like the fact that he threw out some chum for us though. It's a, oh, that's a good one, Nathan. Fighting like, oh, it's like another good sheep's head. Oh, Nathan's hooked up. Nathan's hooked up on a good one. Forgetting which, which way is forward and backward. Oh, that's a good fish right there, though. Fighting like, oh, it's like another good sheep's head. What's going on, everybody? Hopefully, coming back at you with another video today. I'm out here at Matanzas again. This time we got my man Nathan over there. Say what's up, Nathan. Nathan's never launched here, never fished here, so he wanted to fish somewhere. Today is, it's like the second week of March, right? March 15th or something like that. Well, we're gonna go after some sheep's head. St. Augustine Palace Sports got us some uh, fiddler crabs. So we've got two pints of fiddler crabs and we're just gonna see what we can get after. It's gonna be fun. All these fiddlers, two pints, St. Augustine Paddle Sports. Go see David on up there, man, he hook you up. Best bait shop in St. Augustine. Said they've been going crazy this week, trying to get all the all the bait together. But I'm just gonna get this ready so that whenever I feel like fishing, I can just stop and fish. All right, starting out with two fiddlers. We're gonna hop along this line, make it happen. Oh, well, first hit of the day. <laughs> Dude. You get a bite too? Might be small ones. It's definitely a bite. This is the last bait I'll use here unless I catch one. There he is, there he is. Oh, come on, pick it up, eat it. There he is. Ugh. It's making me think it's like a pinfish or something. He's pecking at it. He might have got me. I think he did. <laughs> yeah, I think they're just small. So. Time to roll it. Two or three reds, like right here. Like good size, a uh, good size red just ran by. Dude, this water is super clear right now. Dude, I've never seen it like this. I don't know if y'all can see it. Dude, I've never seen the bottom here. This is wild. This water is super clear right now. Nathan with the first fish getting the skunk off. <laughs> oh you're good i'm fixing to move back forward and drift back almost like what you did just grab him man he's just slimy <laughs> all right here we go i'm gonna drop it right here again Let's see what we can get after Oop, there's a bite. Oh. Oh, oh gosh. Oh. oh, yes. Here we go. Oh, gosh. He's fighting hard. <laughs> well, there's one. There we go. First fish for me for the day. He's going to be probably 13, I would say. He's bump forward worthy. You know what? Let's get the. Uh... Let's get the uh, fish grips on him so we don't lose him. Oop, gosh. Yeah, he's 13. Awesome. He is box worthy. Not a giant by any means. But. Ooh. Cool fish right here. Whew. Well, we're gonna get a picture with him. 
bled out in the box. It's all moving. I hope that was a drop of water. Okay. <laughs> I felt something hit my shoulder. Oh, I'm in a rock. Oh, you did. I think I got somebody's line because it's moving. Unless it's a blenny and he took me into a rock. Oh, dude, are you kidding me? Well, I want that jig head. Oh, Nathan's hooked up. All right. Not a giant one. There we go. Probably 11, maybe 11 and a half, 12. I'm glad they left. <laughs> they pulled up right on the same dock, right, I mean, 10 feet in front of us. Caught a fish on this piling and then he dropped his bait on the same piling. It's wild, it's the man. Same one. I've never had that issue out here. But I guess it's all right. They're moving on now. I do like the fact that he threw out some chum for us, though. It's a, oh, that's a good one, Nathan. That's a good one. Stay with him. Stay with him. You want him to run out. Stay with him, Nathan. Stay with him. I'm trying to get you all on film right here. <laughs> oh, dude, that's a tank. Nathan, get your net. <laughs> Come on. Stay on him. Oh my gosh, Nathan! <laughs> yes, sir! That's a good one, man! <laughs> I got that one on from beginning to end, I believe. I told you they'd be here. He's probably what? I probably at least 17 to 18, right? Oop, there's a bite right there. Come on. Oh, dude, I let, I let him eat too long. I bet a lot. Oh, no, he's back. Oh, there's a good one. That's a good one, too. Oof. Oh, no. He's not as big as Nathan. Oh, gosh, she jumped out of the net. <laughs> Oof. All right. Nathan, we got to get over here and get pictures of this. <laughs> this is going to be a great picture. Yes. That's, that's what I'm saying, man. Like, they threw out that chum and left. They fished it for like three seconds and then left. Where do you think all that chum's flowing in this current? <laughs> right where we were fishing. <laughs> awesome. There we go, baby. Nice one. Let's get measured up. All right, so mine is 14 and a half. Yours is definitely much better. Awesome, 14 and a half inch fish. I'm gonna have to come get, you got him? Dude. Man, we ain't been here 20 minutes. We've got four. All right, here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> 16. He's a nice one, dude. I could tell by the way he hit and he ran. I was like, that's going to be a better one. I was one. just trying to let him go that way, but I can't get him over the tip of my kayak. Yeah. Bleed this old guy out. Got an old purple jig head tied on now, just broke off. Had something pull me on a rock, if I had to guess, I'd say a blenny. But man, you can see all the rocks and stuff below me now. Got hurricane fishing charters over here, if you guys are ever interested. Real nice guy. His uh, sister actually goes to my church. Live over in Stark, but he uh, does run, he runs charters out of South St. Augustine over here. <laughs> Y'all can look him up, I believe, on Instagram and find some links there, or I'll try to link it below. <clears throat> yeah, 
and it's plenty. <laughs> Gotta catch at least one a trip. Oh, dude. <laughs> No, it was a fish. He brought me down into the rock. Gosh. It's definitely a fish, man. They're, they're just chewing on it. I don't know if it's small sheep's head or what, but. Oh, come on, man. <sighs> Must be some sharp rocks then. We're gonna go with a different hook in the crab. See, different angle. See if it makes a difference. <sighs> you forgetting which which way is forward and backwards? Oh, that's a good fish right there, though. That's a good one. Oh, go! Oh, golly! Ooh, that's a good one. I hope I'm recording. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, my gosh! That's a toad right there, man. Oh, gosh. I hope I'm recording. Yes, sir. That's what we like to see. 7% battery. Oh gosh, this is a good one. She got a bull red. I'm gonna show you this tank right here. Yeah. I'm gonna guess 18. Yeah, he's right at 18. Oh, that's a good size red one. <laughs> oh, you got a dolphin straight behind you too, so that's what I'm saying. Nice, man. Congratulations. That's upper slot, right? Awesome. All right, Nathan. Oh, Nathan's hooked up. Nathan's hooked up on a good one. Oh, I just had to replace a battery, so I drifted off like 30 feet. <laughs> Come on, Nathan. <laughs> Stay on him, Nathan. <laughs> Dude, that, that might be another red. Come on, Nathan. <laughs> what is it? Oh, no. Dolphin? Turtle. Huh? Turtle. A turtle? Uh, hey, dude, did you hear what they said? They said, get him, girl. <laughs> <laughs> it's a turtle? Yes, bro. I thought it was oh. That's, I thought it was something huge, man, the way it was bent over like that. Well, Dave, or, uh, Nathan gets the uh, unique catch of the day right here, unfortunately. Oh, I thought that was a fat one. I was like, dude, that is a monster fish. I saw you bow over that, that rod. I was like, dude. Oh, that stinks. It is a turtle, man. Um, I'll do what I can for you if you want me to try if he's oh gosh poor guy oh gosh poor little dude we're gonna turtle if he comes up 
Come on this side, right here, turtle. Come on, turtle. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, hey, come here, come here. Oh, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> well, not exactly. Nathan, I, I I don't know. Where's he hooked? I don't know. I'm trying to flip right him over. Right underneath his front fin. Well, hey, bud. Oh, he's not even past the barb. Oh, yes. Ooh. Do you want to take a picture? <laughs> I mean, I got the camera rolling. Hey, bud. I'm sorry. We'll, we'll toss him back just a second. That's sick. <laughs> Little turtle. Sorry, buddy. Oh, he got me wet. I well. Still got my crab. <laughs> All that I still got the crab on. You had the best fight of the day. Dog. All right, we are back to the spot after Nathan's fiasco and. Sucks. Nathan getting misgendered. 2024. <laughs> See if we can't get on something. Oh, dude, I got a terrible hook set right there. Gosh. Dang, gum it, man. That was a good one. Just to let you guys know this is not what you want to do like they can spearfish and do all that stuff I mean technically you got to have a flag all that kind of stuff that you're diving but you don't want to be running through like middle of boats like that man especially when we're pinned up against these rocks like that I mean, that's not cool oh I got that one though it's a blending Micro Blenny. Oh. I'm gonna bite right here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh gosh. This is a good one. Oh, ooh. fighting like a. Oh, it's like another good sheep's head. Nathan. Look at that one's full of row, man. You can tell right there. That one's probably gonna go back. Oh yeah, you did order one of those, didn't you? He's 17 though, man. She is fat. She is god, look at all that. Dang. What should I do? Huh? Oh gosh. Throwing back everyone that looks bloated like that. <laughs> Dude, that is a chunky, chunky fish. I mean, look how wide that. Yeah. <clears throat> She'll go back. She'll go back. Like you said, we don't need it. We got enough. I do think that they're gonna try to go around us. No. I'm getting Nathan in there too. <laughs> Beautiful sheep said, let's get her in right there. All right, we're gonna turn this girl loose. She is full of row and we, won't, we don't wanna keep her cause we've got enough. We'll keep ones that aren't full of row or a little bit smaller. All right, bud. Come on, Woo! Yeah. <laughs> she said, I'm out. There we go, golly, oh my gosh, oh gosh. <laughs> Come on, baby. Oh, oh, it's another toad, man. Golly. And another one. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, beautiful sheep's head. Tall, super tall. Clean looking. Oh. Just got the camera all wet. 
Don't worry. We got it. Yeah, he's 15 and a half. That's a boxer. Great fish, though. Great fish. Let's get another picture. Get him in the box. Another beautiful sheep said 15 and a half inches. Not the biggest of the day, but a beautiful one. Gotta show the teeth. All right, we're gonna get this one in the cooler. Oh gosh, man, get me all wet. Feels kind of nice. Nathan hooked up. I saw the bite all the way from back here. Looks like a decent one. Come on, Nathan. Get my rod out the way. Oh yeah. Taking some drag. Yeah, that's a good one, man. 16, 15. <laughs> Flying fish. Yeah, there we go. 15. Nice sheep, man. Are you ready? One, two, three. All right, so Nathan, the question is, can you be a good fisherman without having some sort of superstition? What's the superstition? I don't know, that's what I'm asking. Do you have a superstition? So, I've got a particular battery that whenever I throw this one battery inside my GoPro, I always catch fish. So when the bite gets slow, I'll throw that battery in, that's when we'll start catching fish. My superstition is if Bryce is anywhere near me, I don't catch fish. <laughs> that, uh, that, that may be one. <laughs> But, so, you know, we hadn't had a bite in a long time, so I put in the GoPro battery, and that's when we started catching all these fish. Now that battery's dead. Now that battery's dead. Well, <laughs> I got it on a... My sandwich until that one charges back up. <laughs> I got it on a charger, but, uh... Could be a minute. I do have the lucky bananas. If you got superstitions, comment down below when it comes to fishing. What are they? I think I got him. Oh my gosh. Well, it's a new species. We got a toady. They are apparently getting, that's, oh yeah, puffing him up, puffing him up. They are apparently good eating. I've seen deer meat for dinner eat them. I've never eaten one. Did you get him, Nathan? You want to play catch? Hmm? Come on, man. <laughs> he gets stuck right there. Oh my gosh. Play a little ball. He's not spiny, man. You can pick him up. <laughs> oh gosh. Got something. A little blenny. We made it to the Matanzas Bridge. Supposed to be an incoming tide right now. A little bit of wind at our backs. We'll see what we can do. Time, not a big fish. It's a blenny. There you go. Not a big one, doesn't look like. It's a fish, though. Ooh, get me wet. It feels good. Well, He's a tiny one. Hey bud, get off the hook. See if you can get off the hook. Come on, come on. All right, that's fine. Cause you know what, you're a pretty guy. It's cool. 
right there nathan in the background so we gotta go <laughs> missed that hook set it's not a big one it's keeper that's a pretty pretty one he's a he's a like a that, that's picture perfect sheep said he's 11 and three quarter oh still a pretty one might be the last one of the day right here we wrapped it up we're about to get back out on a1a head to the house nathan how was matanzas and Lou? it was great caught so many fish the blenny king yeah <laughs> oh we ended up with uh how many keepers do we have six six total keepers that we kept um caught a few more that we threw back because they were a little bit bloated and you know it's that time of the year where uh they have plenty of row and so make sure they get back they can produce a lot more babies and we can catch a lot more fish especially since we've already had plenty enough for eating but anyway if you're watching up to this point thank you so much for watching uh like the video if you like the content if not be like nathan and don't even subscribe to my channel it's fine <laughs> took him like two years to subscribe but anyway uh like the video if you like the content subscribe if you want to follow along we'll get back at it very soon hopefully but till next time y'all be safe peace out <laughs>